Hello and welcome everyone to another episode of the Journey Day 96. Um, yeah, uh, today was a Monday. Um, Mondays I actually have to go to class. So I did that and I even indexed networks. And before all of that, I woke up at 7 a.m. to work out. And that felt really good to do that. I didn't even nap. Like I had like five hours of sleep, but I managed to get through the day without napping. It's like 10.30 p.m. now though. And I'm pretty, I'm pretty dead. So I think I'm going to go to bed. Uh, <laughs> well deserved, I think. I'm not... I only leveled up to 26. Um, it's going a lot slower than I thought it would. And that's just... Like, that's just the exponential growth, I guess. Um, so getting to level 30 by tomorrow is probably unlikely. But I think I can get to 28 tomorrow. And then... And then we'll see. Uh, because I do have to do two assignments for the day after tomorrow i haven't started those yet so tomorrow i have to you know finish those assignments uh which means i have to spend some time away from league to make sure i can get those assignments done um unfortunately my xp boost will uh, expire by then and that's just yeah just how it's gonna have to be so this whole thing is uh, like the uh, me making videos and stuff it's about capturing the process of uh, going for something that you deep down wish you could achieve. Um, and that something for me is pro gaming, uh, obviously. And that's quite far away from where I am now. And these days I've been noticing more and more how much you really need to, how much you really need to do uh, or learn to be a pro. And uh, that's, that's kind of intimidating. That's that's quite that's actually quite intimidating, um, and and of course I'm not like I'm not saying this with like I have doubts in my mind with what I'm doing and stuff, but it's the kind of thing where you it's like when you're when you're exhausted from a run you never like when you're really exhausted right you never want to go on a run ever again. But then the next day, you want to go on a run again. Like, I mean, that's how, how it happens for me. When I'm really exhausted from a run, and I'm, I feel like I'm about to puke, you, you, you don't want to run again, ever. But it, you, you do want to run again, <laughs> like, at some later time. Uh, and I think that's exactly what this, is, uh, what this is. It's just I've been playing a lot of League these past few days. <laughs> so I... and. And a lot of it is, like, not even... I don't have any variety on the champions. Like, I can only play these few champions. And so it's getting pretty repetitive. And, uh, yeah, it's it's a lot, uh, actually. Uh, I, I, don't, I don't think I'm over, overstating that. Uh, it, it, it is a lot. Um, so, I don't know. It's just a thought. Like, I wanted to capture this because that's really the point of it. That, you know, although I'm sure that what I'm doing right now is making me feel more fulfilled in life, like having a goal or something, or at least something that makes me, like, really makes me think of a goal. Um, and 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 that that's just kind of nice. I, I lost my train of thought. Sorry. I, it, I'm, I, I'm fucking dead. I'm so tired. So I hope I hope this is at all an excuse. I don't think it really is, but... Honestly, honestly, I think, I think I need to give it time. It's just that because I need to give it time, I'm freaking out. I'm in the middle of the, my first semester, oh, I'm sophomore year, in the middle of my fifth semester in college. I'm 20 years old, which is not a gold at all, I, I think. I mean, maybe for, for pro gamers, it's like a normal age. Um, but, you know, I'm pretty far from that still, I think. Uh, but regardless of that, it's it's not like... I think it's likely I would be able to become a professional gamer after I... Um, right, like, right after I graduate. If I want to keep enjoying the journey. Right? I'm, I mean, you probably don't know this but i think that is right um 
And it's just... I really don't want to... Like, it... it, it I feel like it's it. This is what it will come down to, if I want to pursue pro gaming, even when I have an actual job, um, with which to sustain myself with. And that's so. That's such a daunting, daunting decision to make. I don't have to make it now. I know, but I want to know this. I really want to know this sooner rather than later, like, for really, like, really, really sooner th rather than later, because if, if I want to quit pro gaming, if I don't get there, if, if I don't become a professional gamer by the time I graduate, which I don't think will happen, but, like, I mean, it would be cool if it did, but I really don't think it, it, it can happen, like, I, I just realize it's, I don't know, I, it's not like I just realized this, like, I'm not dumb, but I think what I did finally face is that, you know, what I've been saying about you overestimate what you can do in the short term and you underestimate what you can do in the long term. The long term is really long term, like upwards of five years, I think. I think that's kind of the idea behind it. And two years is on the short-term side. Ten years is really when you can expect anything to happen. And I don't know if I want to be a professional gamer in ten years. Because there's so many bigger and perhaps more important things that I would like to, to do in my life. I feel like... I feel like there's a lot of interesting research opportunities that I could get into. There's just... Working in the industry would also be interesting for a little bit, but really just for a little bit. That's None of that is long-term. But, like, what I would envision myself doing for for much longer is perhaps some research. I could see myself doing that for a, a much longer time. Because, like, think about it. You're trying to understand more about the universe, something that humanity has not yet learned. Like, gra capture a new piece of knowledge like that's just crazy the idea to 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 be able to underst to understand more about the universe yes but it's more like like fucking this is all we know okay the universe right this is this is our the earth for for most people who haven't gone to the moon or you know whatever this is the only place that we know what if we could learn more about the only place that we possibly can know? Like, that, I feel like that's just like inherently so interesting. So I, that's something I would like to pursue for a, a long term as well. But it's like, I don't think I want to stay there. Like, what do I want to do with the rest of my life? What the fuck? Like, how can you even like sit down and like decide on something obviously obviously you're not going to be able to you know f make a plan and then expect that to to be right like you're going to sway so much from it you can only make a prediction and and i predict my life like i'm quite confident that whatever i'm doing i i'm going to be very very um enthusiastic about making it better or like doing it better like optimizing everything and stuff like that i'm that's just kind of how my mind works um and i i'm not like i just can't stand uh being unenthusiastic at especially at work like having to do work that you hate or that's boring is the dumb is just the that there's nothing worse for me I I remember I, I I worked at a grocery store um, over the summer and there were a lot of times where there was actually nothing for me to do and so I was just kind of standing there in the aisles and I had to check the dates of the products to make sure that they're not expired but they're fucking in the system like this was not I didn't have to do any actual work and it was just time passed by so slowly you I'm sure you know this feeling and 
to, to, to like so 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 I know I'm gonna be excited about something is about whatever I do uh, is my is my is my point here um, trying to be a little more focused but pro gaming is the kind of thing I want to do it I, I'm not sure if I care that much about being the very best at this one video game I do care about being good at it I do, I hate being bad at it, especially because I know I can be so much better, mm, but I have to wonder if it's fulfilling enough, and the, the the things that have been making it fulfilling for me, and they still exist, which is why this is still fulfilling for me, is the idea of capturing, just like, capturing the, the moment I was just sitting down, I'm like, yeah, I'm just I'm going to I'm going to have to do this and like being serious but about it in my mind in 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 for myself very serious about it. Um and and the breadth of different emotions it, I think it has invoked in me is really cool. Like there was one time where I just felt like I was in fucking heaven like I'm doing everything I had ever wanted to do in life and I can see my purpose and stuff. Uh, it's good stuff. It's really nice, and I want to capture the moment of the the moments, like the whole, the the whole journey of it. That's that's what I mean. Doing this shit every day for, like, every day, and so that's a drive for sure. That's a that's a that's a motivation for me. I want to be able to influence other people in a good way. I want to be able to, I don't know, give, t show people, not give people something. I want to just to show them that, like, whatever it is that I guess would be interesting that, or not interesting, what am I talking about? That whatever it is that they would be most excited about in their life that they shouldn't f just turn their back on it. I don't want anybody who's watching this to turn your back on something you would genuinely really like to do. Because what's the fucking point of living? I mean, this is nothing new. But I think just showing the process of this would be incredible. And if so far for me, it's brought only good things. Only good things. But... If I was somebody else and I were to watch this, if I were to see the journey and I would see as somebody and I would see this guy start it talking about talking all sorts of shit about how he's going to do this and how he's going to pursue this and and how he wants to show that, you know, it can only bring good things, but then like stopping halfway through, I, I wouldn't be like. I wouldn't be affected by it at all. I'd be like, oh, damn, he did this for a, a hundred days. That's cool, I guess. But it's there's no, there's nothing more substantial than that. So what's my purpose, I guess, is what it comes down to. And you don't ever know. How do you fucking know your purpose? Like, yeah, you, I can say that, like... I can say all sorts of shit because it's all something you make up in your own mind in the first place. But, like, I don't know. I don't know. I feel like I, I've been really fortunate in, in my life. I have great, great parents, great family. I have met such great people in my life. And so, so, would it be a waste if I just, like, if, I feel like it would almost, I don't know if I even feel that anymore. I used to believe that it would be a waste if I then just, you know, become a normal worker. Like, that's just, what the fuck? But... These days, I don't care about normal or not. Like, I just want to do what I want to do, even if a million other people want to do it. I don't 
give a shit. If it's if it fulfills me, isn't that good enough? The point of living is to live. Okay. What I've been doing these days has it really been just to live? Like, has this really been? I've been missing out on on some really cool opportunities on purpose like it was a conscious decision and it was a fair decision and i stand by it but it's like you gotta you gotta understand your pros and cons and the cons of this is that there's a bunch of experiences that i'm missing out on in order to play league and hope and and hopefully get the experience and that would be a fucking that would be worth it 100 percent. but it's just not guaranteed um it, it, the, the the experience of pursuing something 100% being dedicated to this and then finally getting there and and all of the like the growth for me as a person that would give is so much bigger than any like country I could visit right that's so much bigger to me and the contribution i could give to to society or maybe not society i don't really i don't know if i care about society i don't know but just individuals that would watch these videos this very video to impact them to like to actually i don't know i don't i don't know like make it be more of a it's already such a like a, a common thing where people say like oh you should you should do the best with your life because you've only got this one life and shit yolo am i right but but it's more than that it's like the idea of structuring your entire life ba not your entire life that's too much that's too much that fucking hurts me to think about it it's too much it god damn it i i'm talking to myself with this part by the way it's, it's just too much for me i i cannot imagine just dedicating my one my life to this one thing and nothing else that's just in in unimaginable for me and it if if i tr it, when i try to imagine it it feels so solemn if that makes any sense it's kind of like when you think back on before you were alive uh, like what was that and it's just you're kind of I don't know, you didn't exist, like, you, nothing, it was nothing, right? But now that we're alive and we can put, like, a label on how that was, it, I would say it's super solemn. Just kind of feels super alone. And, and, and so I really don't, <laughs> just fucking tangents. I, so I really don't want to... To, to have to decide on these one this big thing I would like for people to as well just again give people or put the idea or create some thought process within somebody else that could possibly and more likely the more likely the the, 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 the higher the probability the better make them really sit down and think about what they would like to have in their life what they would like to have achieved or something that they they know subconsciously they turned their back on it and and and, and you you, you kind of like it's kind of in the back of your mind and but you never address it because because you really don't want to think about it um but to to turn to face it, to turn around and face it and f think about what would my life look like if I did do this? Like, that's what I, that's, that's what I want to show. I think if, if there was an individual that came up to me 10 years from now and was like, I, I don't know, like an individual who's, I don't know, accomplished whatever they wanted to accomplish or even just not, not even having accomplished it or when i don't I'm not even having accomplished it but 
just is working towards it and being like this has made the quality of my life exponentially better or not exponentially better that's like nobody would say that like what the fuck it would come up to me and and would and and tell me your videos have inspired me to take action towards my own dream and now i'm living the way i want to live and with with a purpose with a drive and that's something i'd never done before and i'm so so i'm so overwhelmed with how how much it really is diff, how how different it really is um and 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 all that like i don't know if that moment ever were to happen i just kind of i'd just be shook i i would be like i have no idea that i'm actually doing something good for other people that i'm actually able to help other people and have a positive impact on their life like i don't know i think that's that's just that'd be really cool i'd really like that uh, i've been going on for 20 minutes huh <laughs> the journey that, but that's what it's about, you know? That's what I want this to be about, to show the process of it. Like, there have already been so many crazy moments, and like, so many crazy moments where it's... It, 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 I don't even think that it, you can capture it on the, on the screen, because all you really see me do is say, hello, everyone, and welcome to another episode of The Journey Day, blah, 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 you know? But... I don't know, just kind of explaining what I'm doing and how I'm feeling at the time, even though it's probably the same thing over and over. It has something. That consistency, that has something. I think. I don't know. I guess I just kind of wanted to, to talk about it to make it more of a thing on, on these daily videos. I don't know. I, sh I see, like... Some of my videos actually have, like, over 10 views. And I actually think that's crazy. Because, like, 10 people saw me talk about my day. Why the fuck do people do this in the first place? But I really appreciate it. Especially when you're, if you're watching this, like, 20, almost 23 minutes into the video. It's like, that's so cool. I'm glad that I'm able to bring something to you that makes you feel like this is worth it for 23 minutes it's so rare these days anyways even if you're not like super focused on it like even if you skip around like especially like i wouldn't i would skip around on these videos <laughs> i skip around on these videos don't feel bad about that please i think i think i think that the main idea still gets across even if you skip around uh, so i don't i don't care Yep, okay. Well, that's it for the day. Thanks so much for watching. As I just explained why I'm grateful actually for for watching. Can we can we see some muscle improvement? Ooh, that's that's hair. I'm oh, not in this light. I swear, I swear my muscles are getting bigger. This is probably really it's it's not bad, right? It's getting there. You know. You know, it was worse before. But I swear it's the lighting. Maybe like this. Oh no, this makes it worse, no? Okay. Well, I'm just gonna keep working out and then hopefully over time it'll look really like don't, don't fucking judge me now, you little bitch. Don't do that. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Thanks so much for watching. Tag along for the ride. See how all these things go. Uh, I, I really hope I can bring enough value to get you guys interested on this because I think it holds so much value. Uh, yeah, I hope I can inspire anybody to start thinking about, you know, what their life would look like if they, if you, if you faced some of these things that you'd kind of maybe been pushing yourself away from just like subconsciously avoiding kind of like a procrastination thing. I don't know. I would, I would like to, to encourage anybody to do that. Cool. So yeah, that's it. That's it for the day. Um. So I hope that you have a wonderful day. Rocky.